Okay, friends, we're back with part two of our making a puppet in an hour video. Uh, this is what we've got so far for a head, and I think this is gonna be the most complex part of our puppet. Uh, now we're gonna make a neck, a body, and some arms, and maybe throw a shirt on them. Uh, so let's see how this is gonna go. I've pre-cut some foam, so we don't have to worry about that. Altogether, I have spent about 40 minutes uh, cutting and assembling for this guy, uh, but I took a break for a day, and they're gonna see where we go from here. Okay, we are going to build the neck. So I have these three pieces of foam that I've cut. This has a uh, curve at the top. Uh, it's gonna be about yay, so I can fit my arm inside. Um, and it's gotta fit into this hole on the back of our puppet. So I'm gonna glue that and see where we go from there. Okay, now that we have our neck assembly, we're gonna put down what's going to be our skin. And this is gonna hold the whole thing together. So, let's glue this down. Homie's got a neck now. Some glue on his head. Not bad. Let's make the rest of the body. All right, next we're gonna clean it up a little bit, make it look nice before we just start attaching arms and whatnot. So let's glue down the neck, glue stick. Okay, friends, so we have our puppet components uh, and we're gonna put it all together. But I thought instead of putting it together by gluing it all, I would use a nice shirt. So our guy isn't naked. Uh, this was my daughter's. Uh, it is now Puppet Steve's, I don't know. So the first thing I'm gonna do is put it over the body, like so. One of the last things we're gonna have to do for our awesome puppet friend is to attach a articulator to his hand, which is gonna stick, it's gonna make it move. Now, I like to put my guy on my right hand, and that means I'll wanna put it here so he can move around with me. You, know, you wanna keep it on the inside of your body. So, here we go. So 
there we go. We got a fully articulated, uh, well, almost fully articulated puppet. Uh, there are some tricks we could do, like putting Velcro for things like the eyebrows or the eyes, so you could kind of move them around and give them emotions, but not bad for an hour's worth of work. If you want to see this program at your event, uh, just contact us at my uh, myproductionct.com. Oops, sorry. Uh, and we can and we can set up something. Uh, we'll bring all the pieces pre-cut, so you don't have to worry about that. Uh, all the materials will be taken care of for a low, low rate. Uh, see you around, folks, and uh, have a great day. Yeah, have a great day. Okay, the ventriloquism I'm not up on.